In this video, you'll see how to make these gorgeous roses using Italian meringue buttercream and then arranging them with snippets of fresh flowers. You'll need a tip number 104 for the petals, a damp paper towel to keep the tip clean as you pipe, a flower nail, and some wax paper if you plan on freezing them. The wide end of the tip is always facing down for this. Angle the tip inward to form a volcano shape. Turning your nail left or right, it doesn't really matter. The goal here is to form a base for the petals. For the center of the flower, pipe a ribbon. And for this one, you want to angle it even more in because you want this to be pretty tight. And you're going to bring it down at an angle as well, all the way down to the nail. Then begin making your petals. I'm bringing my petals left to right. You could literally go either way and I have gone both ways for the petals. Leave a little bit of space so you can begin the next petal inside the previous petal. This is where my new technique comes in. The old roses that I made before were the Wilton method and those are a little different. I have a link at the end of the video if you wanna go check that one out. It's still beautiful, it's just a different style. You can add your own variations to your roses. I like to ruffle the petals and create more texture and realism with jagged edges and imperfect petals. Each rose comes out slightly unique. Here's a close up of the starting point of each petal. A few ruffled additions at the bottom of the flower make it appear full blown. This is a number 125, it's a petal tip, but I'm using it to add some greenery at the bottom of the flower. This is optional. This is actually the first time I've done this with a rose. Again, creating an illusion. You can pipe the leaves after you place it onto your cake if you prefer. And you can also use a regular leaf tip. Here's an example of an arrangement using three buttercream roses. I'm adding frozen pre-made leaves to one of them. Then my favorite finishing touch is to add small snippets of fresh greens and flowers. These are from my garden. Click the playlist here to see more buttercream flowers. Click this playlist to see the old rose tutorial. And click the join button to find out more about my Zoom classes. See you in the next video.